All right, we're five minutes into the cycle. Pump's doing nothing. Came out of harvest. And we're beginning to frost up. We got no pump. All right, that's what I need to know. It's number three code, folks. And there's the other shoe. The pump is getting warm. Um, if I remember right. Yep, it's got plastic pieces missing. Yeah, and there's more in there. All right, I think I know what might be going on here. Usually means something is inside there. There's water. And there it is, right there, right there. Gotta get this cover off. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna come out of there. So what happens with these machines is you get these things. Now you're gonna ask, well, hey, what what the hell is that? I'll show you. Get the picture? It's your ice guide. You get a big chunk of ice that hits this thing, busts this thing up. This is just plastic. It wears. It's, it's really bad design. But get this, these pieces like that caught in the pump. You can burn up the pump or you can or sometimes the pump can come back so what we got to do is we got to replace this ice guide and possibly the motor who knows i'll put it all back together and see if we see if we get uh some pump action again turns all right all right we got it all but back up Remember, this one goes on the outside, folks, not the inside. We don't want to pump out our water, our water. I've seen it. All right, I've checked. Up inside here, the pump out valve. I didn't see any other pieces. I didn't see any in the sump. And I didn't see up any up in the drain tube, so, or uh, water supply system so let's see what we get all right we're in fill mode and here the water coming through right now coming through here and going in here in between the middle of the evaporator as you can see And you can hear water draining already from the machine. Oh, that's pretty fast. All right. Considering the sump was totally empty, that's pretty fast. All right, now the compressor's on. We're going to start warm. The hot gas valve is open. It's sending hot gas from the discharge line into this side of the TXD valve, into this line. And this line is warming up. It 
Oh, the drain is getting louder in the back. Okay, cool. Now, this is what I want to see. Come on, hurry, get the 50, 48 degrees. Hurry up, hurry up. Well, actually, it's got to get to 48 degrees. Here, 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 here. Over here. So this is the outlet right here. There we go. We got a pump. We do. We got a pump. All right. Cool. Now, now we time the cycle and see how well she does. All right. We just went in the harp in 27 minutes. Okay, the ice did clear in the back. All right, that's, that's good. But see those holes? That's where the that's where the plastic's missing. It can hold the ice. I don't like that. And that section way in the back is cracked. You can see the line that runs right through the center, and it's cracked right at the end. So I'm not liking that. We got to get a new ice guy in there. All right, we've got to replace that in here. This is how incredibly difficult this is. Pull this. <laughs> yeah, doing one hand can be a little bit more difficult. And as you can see, it's got the bin stat closed. Oh, look at there. Look at there. It's trying to get out. Which is helpful because it's got to come out. And that's why it's got to come out. That, and there's a crack over on this side somewhere. There's that crack. 
There it is. So this one's all messed up. So we gotta get that one in there. Come on. They're making them fit just a little tighter than they used to. Alright, there you go. It doesn't want to go in easy. It doesn't come out easy either. And now it doesn't want to line up. Alright, it's that stupid tab in the back back there. But that's basically it right, right there. Make sure that piece sits up inside there like that. Yeah. Looks much better. 